Hello, I'm Steve Grafton, President of the Alumni Association of the University of Michigan. You know, one of the things that I've learned in my time at Michigan is that U of M alumni form an intelligent and curious community. Even though you've left the university, you never stop learning. Fortunately, there are more opportunities than ever before to continue learning from U of M and in doing so to strengthen your Michigan connection. Today I'm here with Dr. Martha Pollack, the university's next Provost and Executive Vice President for Academic Affairs. Dr. Pollack was very instrumental in the university's involvement in Coursera, a new online learning platform that combines and distributes educational content from some of the nation's greatest universities. Dr. Pollack, welcome. Thank you. Thank you, Steve. And glad that you came to be with us today. And Thank you. I wonder if you could just start maybe by sharing why you think it's important for the University of Michigan to be involved in a partnership like Coursera. Sure, sure. I, you know, I think there's several reasons. Um, First of all, we could see that this was the way the world was going and we wanted to be a leader, not a follower, to help shape, mm -hmm. shape the space. Uh, secondly, we think this is a great way to reach out to our alumni, which I know you care a lot about, as well as prospective students. Third, it's consistent with what we do all the time. As faculty members, we always share our expertise. We write papers, we give performances, we reach out to the world. Fourth, we think there might be a little bit of an alternative revenue stream there. And fifth, and really very important to us, is we think that the way education happens on campus is going to change. We're going to do more hands-on integrative learning, but at the same time, we're going to be using this kind of online technology. And this was a great way for us to get experience in that technology. And I wonder if you might talk just a bit about the kind of change you expect that this could mean for the university and higher education in general. Yeah, well, you know, I think we're in a period of really rapid change, and I, and I don't have a crystal ball. Um, but I think we're seeing changes really a lot of experimentation with different ways of using this technology on campus. So one thing we're seeing is faculty beginning to record lectures so that they can take some of the more canned material out of the classroom and use the classroom time for integrative kinds of activities. We're also seeing things like the use of technology that lets students interact in real time in big classrooms. There are just a whole host of experiments that we're looking at here on campus. When I think about all of these changes on campus, I also go to what does it mean for alumni? who are not on campus every day, but would like to take advantage of some of this? Well, you know, already we have courses uh, on a number of topics from finance to science fiction and fantasy, and we have more that are being developed right now from the School of Music, from medicine, from engineering, so there's really a breadth of courses that they can take. Well, it is so exciting, and, uh, and your leadership has been really instrumental in this, and so we thank you for that. Thank you for taking time to be with us today, and, uh, and look forward to all of the exciting parts of this that are still to come. Thank you, Steve. It's yeah, been great talking you. with you. And if you'd like to learn more about Coursera, then I encourage you to read A New World of Teaching in the spring issue of Michigan Alumnus Magazine. And to help you personally tap into the vast resources that are available at the University of Michigan, the Alumni Association has created an online catalog with on-demand lectures, podcasts, videos, and live events. You can find it on our website. And now, on behalf of the University and the Alumni Association, I'd like to thank you for being a part of the alumni family. Yours for Michigan, I'm Steve Grafton.